Siri, call Shambooty. Hello? Girl, did you get that invoice they sent over? Because a real bitch is broke. Ah, oh, last night, Kev, I got a yoni massage. Girl, what in the world is the yoni massage? Have you ever had a sexual experience before where... Girl, you know I'm a virgin. So can I tell you about this yoni massage? Shan, get off my phone. We must have got disconnected. In this video, I'm gonna walk you through how to give a yoni massage, which is an awakening, arousing, awesome experience for yourself or to perform on a partner. Now, everything that I learned, I got from Beducated's Yoni Massage course. Beducated has 100 plus online courses on sex and intimacy created by the world's top experts. Learn about everything from self-pleasure to kink all in one place with their video tutorials, practical exercises, and reliable information. Here's the best part. Everyone watching right now, go over to Beducated, use my code SHAMBOOTY because you're gonna get 24 hours all access free pass to roam around and see what they have to offer. And if you like what you see, you're gonna have a 14 day risk-free money back guarantee trial. Plus that code SHAMBOOTY is gonna get you 50% off a yearly pass. Okay. Okay, we're back for real. So, a good yoni massage starts out with four pillars. One is communication. So you have to have this really beautiful, heartfelt, connecting conversation. And then he asked me if he could worship my body. Like, yes, and we know consent is sexy, girl. And then speaking of sexy, he lays it all out. He gives me the intention. Here's what I'm gonna do. Here's how I'm gonna do it. No surprises. This was what your body is about to experience. And then lastly, he sets the stage for this no judgment space by offering affirmations to my yoni to make sure that I feel comfortable being busted wide open. Bitch, call me Pillsbury. Okay, so this is where things start to get physical. First, he gives me a full body massage, and I mean like a focused, full, good massage. And then he does this exercise, it's called breast awakening. So in essence, a lot of people just rush straight to the nipple, but instead he just brought the blood, the life to the whole area. So for a minute, he just cupped the outsides of my breasts. Yeah, just like giving them space to acknowledge or about to get touched. And then he does this sweeping motion with his fingers where he's almost like bringing the blood or the energy to the nipple without actually touching the nipple yet. So just imagine just like pushing everything to the center, but softly and then a little bit more firm and then soft again. And then after that, he takes two of his fingers and then he swirls around the nipple and then puts the pressure back to the outside. So imagine you get this build up to the center and then he releases the tension. Then he takes the palm of his hand and he just hovers it over the nipple and just does that for the longest while. And then finally lightly touches it and then keeps pressing and pressing and pressing until his palm is flat against my heart. I don't know how to respond to that, sweetie, because I've known you a long time and you having a heart is a stretch. Okay, anyways, moving on. Now on to the fun part. This is called Yoni Blossoming. What is that? Look at you getting into the story. Okay. So he took his palm and he put it over my entire vulva. I'm talking from the perineum all the way to the very top of the clitoris and then just held it and cupped it like a hug. So by this point, obviously my yoni is blossomed and now he gets into pussy shiatsu. Sounds like sushi friend, but go on. Pussy shiatsu. It's like a series of techniques that you do starting with the labia majora, you know, the big hairy lips. Uh, yeah, I definitely can't relate to anything big and hairy. Okay, so what he does is he takes the big hairy lips and then he slides his fingers up and down them 
and then he pinches the skin and pulls it away from the body like gently but also firmly at the exact same time and then he starts playing the piano on the outer lips just like getting the blood flow to all the areas and all the while he's checking in on me does this feel good are you comfortable do you want more of something do you want less of something and i'm like obviously more 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 so he starts using his knuckles and massaging up and down the big lips and then he starts to do this exact same thing but for the small lips this time <sighs> Okay, buckle up, baby, because we're getting good clitoris right now. So the first thing that he does is he starts by acknowledging and then playing with the clitoral hood. I mean, girl, I'm like, if anybody's trying to play with my hoodie. And then he puts his fingers on either side of the clitoris and then starts moving his fingers and the whole clitoris up and down. You know, like that motion, but like that. Okay, so then after that, he takes his thumb and then presses on either side. And then almost like he's taking the pulse and seeing like how hot, how wet, how fast she is. He uses his thumb and presses it to one side and then rests it and then takes his thumb and presses it to the other side. Now at this point, Kev, I am ready to go all the way, but that is not the point of a good yoni massage. So he takes his hands off all together, about to scream. And then he puts them down on my perineum and starts to give me a perineum massage. No, I don't even know what that is. You know, the taint, the gooch. That's the Gucci. <laughs> yes, the part between the front and the back, exactly. So he starts off by vibrating that area with his knuckles, just giving a lot of firm pressure. And then he starts massaging it with his fingertips and then, oops, his fingertips slip on the inside. Now, what was really cool about this is that Often when you're being penetrated, it's a <gasps> experience because someone's coming into your body. But instead it was an exhale because he de-armored me. He made sure with consent, he made sure that I was comfortable, he asked if it felt good. Just again, just really communicative the entire time. We just made it so safe and so sexy. And then he did this technique that he goes around the clock, like literally hour by hour, inch by inch, giving it love, tapping, pressing, just holding each hour, so 12 o'clock, one o'clock, two o'clock, three o'clock, four o'clock, five o'clock, six o'clock, seven o'clock. I'm going really fast, but it was, mm -hmm. it felt like time wasn't even an object. Yep. By the time that this man got all the way around the clock to 12 again, I was lost. But I do know that he found my G-spot and he stayed there. Doing all the favorites, the stroking, the pressure, that come here motion. He found it, honey. Then he repositions himself, and when he comes back at it, the angle is easier for him to use his entire arm to go inside of me. Like, that kind of pressure? And I know what you're thinking, this story has to be done by now, but it's not, because we still had the cervix to massage. And like you, you're probably thinking right now, cervix massage, that area is kind of uncomfortable and painful. But because so much care had already been placed to the area and I was in such a deep state of relaxation, deep penetration, which usually is a little uncomfortable, I fell into it. Like he fell into it. His fingers just gravitated to the area. And then he started to run on the cervix. I mean, I knew she was loose. Yeah, it's kind of a weird explanation, but like take your hand right now and then just put your fingers like in a running, like a running man motion. Yeah. So just awakening it, bringing blood to the area, bringing relaxation. Then of course, since he's up there, he found the A spot. Started giving me a nice A spot massage, both to the front and to the back. And then we just played for, I don't know, maybe like half an hour or more, just enjoying and massaging and experiencing. Um, and when we both felt like it was done, he backs away from me and then says thank you and then takes his hand and puts it over my entire yoni again, giving it that yoni blossoming hug and then takes his other hand and puts it over his heart. And then when I tell you this man opened his mouth and said the most beautiful, affirming, sexy things to me. Oh my God, what did he say? You really wanna know? So he said that 
If you need a reminder, you can sign up to Beducated with my code SHAMBOOTY and test the waters with a 24 hour full access free trial. The number one resource for sexual health and happiness where you can level up your love life because Maybe Jared or myself can't come over and give you a yoni massage personally, but you can learn everything that we know and more from their top experts. Or perhaps there's something else you wanna learn about in their 100 plus course library, ranging from exotic dancing to anal play to emotional well being to the secrets of great rough sex. Trust me when I tell you everyone can level up their love or lust making life with the help of Beducated. And in classic Shambuti style, I'm gonna tell you how you can do it for free. Everyone can go over to Beducated right now. Use the code SHAMBOOTY to get 24 hours all access free pass to see what they have to offer. And if you like what you see, that code SHAMBOOTY will get you half off a yearly pass. Plus, this is gonna get you a 14 day money back guarantee. Yes, you're welcome.